Thiago sat back on form. Since his injury comeback, Thiago has featured in just 96 minutes of football for Liverpool. That's been good news for Curtis Jones, but always seemed ominous for the Spaniard, who was clearly never quite right. Sure enough, the Times has now confirmed that Thiago will miss the rest of the season, with Liverpool deciding along with the player that the minor operation is the best course of action. The procedure will aim to put an end to the hip issue that has blocked him for much of the campaign. Hopefully, Thiago will return as good as ever, but this little setback is just another piece in the Liverpool midfield rebuild puzzle. Even if his hip is fixed, the 32 years old has always been injury prone, a trait unlikely to reduce as he enters his autumn years. Whichever way the issue is sliced, the former Barcelona and Bayern Munich star is not the long-term future of Jurgen Klopp's engine room. With a contract that trans until the summer of 2024, Liverpool will need to confront a big decision soon. Regardless of the outcome of that conversation, it is clear that the availability must be high up club's midfield wishlist as the club enters a critical transfer window. Liverpool's $110 million power play Liverpool is plotting a completely irresistible offer to price away that star player from one of its direct Premier League rivals. That's according to Ficha Jest, which claims Liverpool is preparing a bid as high as $110 million around 88 million parceling or 100 million euro for Newcastle United's Bruno Gomerez. Club has stopped off a Brazil star as part of his rebuild and is keen to add him. He certainly appears to fit the Thiago transfer criterion, having missed a total of five camps through injury or illness across his entire career. As for his quality, that is beyond doubt, having been comprehensively proven at the top end of the Premier League. One major sticking point comes in the form of Jude Bellingham. Whenever transfer fees in this ballpark are mentioned, it is impossible to ignore the fact that FSG back away from a generational Borussia Dortmund star in part so as to spread its investment more widely across the team. To then go and splash a huge sum on somebody else would be hard to fathom. Then again, Bellingham will likely to attract an even higher fee than this, so perhaps Liverpool can rationalize it. Getting Newcastle to sell, on the other hand, could prove an insurmountable hurdle. Till I get up, time is barely on our side